Hello everyone and welcome back to my tutorial. And today we will talk about the map Open Street map. So you can see right there now on your screen, you can get it just by a few clicks and by Dynamo. Of course we will use the some add-ins. Uh, actually it's for free of course and you can try it right now. So let's get start. So as always, open your Revit and after that go to straight away to the manage find here the Dynamo. Uh, the main thing you should use Dynamo new one. It's two points O and above, so you cannot use the uh, low than two points O. Uh, the reason is because you not be able uh, download this package for your Dynamo. Okay, so let's open up Dynamo straight away. The first thing, don't forget, first thing you should may change the settings. Go to the settings and find here, find here geometry scaling, and use extra large. Why we are using the extra large? Because we will load now city map, and that's why we need the extra large. If you not will change it, you not will see geometry. Let's say apply. The second thing we should download the, this package Dynamo Maps. How we can do that? Go to the package, find here the search for a package and write here, yes of course the accept the changes and write here Dyna Maps and enter. So now it will be connected to the server and uh, Revit will uh, give you like uh, the choice what you can download it. So it's not working. Let's do one more time. Ah, it's worked, sorry. It's taking the time. So if it's taking the time, as you can see, aha, uh -huh, here, you can see Dynamo Maps. And just click on this button, install latest, latest version. So the my version is already latest one, I don't need it. But you can just click on that and wait like uh, one minute and you will get Dynamo Maps. While you will get Dynamo Maps, you will see it here at Dance and you will get this new button here. Okay, before we will do some changes, what you should do? You should find the place what you wanna load inside to the Revit, I mean the city. How you can do that? Go to the view and under the view you will find here Dynamo Maps, click on that. Okay, awesome. What we're gonna do next? Next, uh, we'll open the, the open street map, and now you should find here the place which you wanna load inside to the Revit. I mean, the side to Dynamo. So let's say this is, will be New York. Why it will be New York? Because the New York it's fully scanned, and I hundred percent sure uh, the New York uh, will be like uh, on the hundred uh, percent uh, detailed. So that's why. Yeah. Uh, let's see, for example, Park Row, mm -hmm, here, Park Row. Uh, what you have now to do, you can write your address if you want and take me there. And you wanna make, for example, coordinates, so here is the tips how you can use the coordinates. After that, you can just click on the push to Dynamo or you can export OSM file. OSM, it means open street map. So if you want, for example, but we will use the push to Dynamo because we are working in Dynamo right now. Just click on that, wait like a few minutes. Okay, we are done. Actually, now you can uh, just uh, close this uh, screen or you can leave it. Uh, I will I will leave it on the right side here. It's not uh, it's not disturbing me. Let's go to now to the Dynamo and we will find here the life and buildings. So now I will use, for example, let's we'll start from the polygons. I wanna see, I wanna show you how it's working with the polygons. Of course, you cannot now see anything because uh, we should go to the 3D, enable 3D background mode, and let's zoom to fit. And now you can see, here is our city. Now you can see only the polygons from the building, because I said buildings and polygons from the building. Now you can use the, for, for example, the road. Let's make it. Uh, I'm changing the uh, my style from the 3D to the notes mod and uh, it sometimes it's not working my pen that's why I'm doing that one so and let's go to the road and here you will find the polycurve slow road now you can see the road okay same the thing you can find for example top of surface you can uh, able to the load inside like the points or the top of surface and even the trees yes even the trees uh, you able so as you can see only a few trees but so this is open street map only 11 trees anyway anyway this is also a nice feature so uh, i will delete the trees i will delete the roads and i will delete also the footprints of the uh, my buildings i will show you how you can 
import geometry. Let's go again to the live. You will find here the buildings. Find here the buildings footprint surface. So let's click on that. Just wait for a while because we have like so huge area and Revit will get our surface into the Dynama. Okay, here we are. As you can see, here is my node. Let's go back to the 3D background mode and let's fit it up. Let's fit it up and let's rotate it. So is my where is my city? So here is my city, as you can see. Let's go back to the node mode. Uh, again, my pen is not working. I should do like this twice. So and we get the building footprint surfaces here, as you can see on the, your screen. So what we're gonna do next? Next, we want uh, also get the topo topography from that side. So let's use the topography surface, and it's also the take the time not much as the uh, building foot footprint surface uh, as you can see here is my topography okay uh, this topography uh, it's mostly triangulate as you can see it's triangles uh, you can use top uh, points and after that convert it uh, from the rabbits to the uh, top surface so this will be much better the result but anyway if you don't want to spend the time you can use the top surface too okay as I said uh, the main most uh, main thing what we want to Go and do with this uh, everything we want to uh, push our buildings so here is our project uh, building on the top let's use it and now you should just connect surface to the uh, foot the print surface elevation to building elevation and top to the top of polyline just again wait hold on and you will get now all buildings with real scale size as you can see on the right on your screen and if you will rotate you will see everything all the buildings uh, get information from the open street map so it's working and as you can see this is looks pretty pretty well to support my channel you can go to gumroad check that my store there you can find bottle of this dynamo scripts or you can buy two-story complete house or even the two-story residential classic house. By this way you supporting my channel and you making me happy to creating the new videos for you guys. And that's it from today, thank you guys for watching, don't forget to subscribe my social media, leave some comments for this video and give some like and see you next time.